हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम खान सरवत अंजुम साइंस टीचर श्री सरस्वती भुवन हाई स्कूल औरंगाबाद टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न फर्स्ट चैप्टर ऑफ साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी सेकंड हेरिडिटी एंड इवोल्यूशन स्टूडेंट्स टेल मी डज इट एवर हैपन दैट एनी स्ट्रेंजर आइडेंटिफाई यू एज अ चाइल्ड ऑफ योर पेरेंट्स यस मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम एंड लॉट ऑफ us has such experience i also remember that when i was young when i was child mom when i met to my father's friends they always told me told me that uh, i look like my father and uh, when i met my mother's friends they also to- told me that i look like look like my mother at the time i got, i also i really got confused at the time but now i realize that i am not like exactly i am not exactly like my father and i am not exactly like my mother i am combination of both now i understand that some characters of both the parents get transferred from them to their offsprings and this is nothing but the heredity heredity is the transfer of biological characters from one generation to another generation via genes for example skin color hair color hair pattern hair type height eye color iq etc genetical characters transfer via gene then what is a gene segment of dna which code for a particular character dna have a different character different codes they have a particular character they are coded in the particular codes genetics is a branch of science concerned with the study of genes genetic variation and heredity johann gregor mendel is pioneer of the modern genetics he studied the inheritance of some characteristics of pea plant he showed that inheritance of these characteristics follows certain principles later these principles become popular by his name some prim- principles are now f- form the basis of the modern genetics in 1901 the reason behind this sudden change were understood due to the mutational theory of yogo d rice in 1902 walter and sutton observed the paired chromosomes in the cells of the grasshopper until then it was not known to anyone research started in the direction of finding the nature of the genetic genetic materials when it was proved that genes are carried by chromosomes through 1944 trio of scientists ostwald avery maclean mccarthy and colin maclean proved that except viruses all living organisms have dna as a genetic material the french scientist francois jacob and jack monard proposed a model for process of protein synthesis with the help of dna in bacterial cell it helped to uncover the genetic code hidden in dna thereby the technique of recombinant dna technology emerged which has vast scope in the field of genetic engineering the science of heredity is useful for diagnosis treatment and prevention of hereditary disorders production of hybrid varieties of animals and plants and in the and in industrial processes in which microbes are used that means for mankind for welfare of mankind gen- science of genetics or science of heredity is used transcription translation and translocation see the slide dna is there in the slide dna is there dna means deoxyribonucleic acid chromosomes are made up of dna discovered by biochemist frederick mischer in 1869 
molecules of dna are present in all organisms from viruses and bacteria to human beings these molecules control the functioning growth and division that means reproduction of the cell and are therefore called master molecules see the structure of dna molecule is same in all organism in 1953 watson and crick produced a model for dna which you are which you are seeing on the screen as per this model two parallel threads of nucleotides are coiled around each other this arrangement is called as a double helix this structure can be compared with a coiled and flexible ladder each strand of dna is made up of small molecules that is nucleotide there are four types of nitrogenous bases adenine guanine cytosine and thymine in the structure of nucleotide a molecule of a nitrogenous a nitrogenous base and phosphoric acid and are each joined to a molecule of sugar nucleotides are arranged like a chain in a molecule of dna the two threads of dna molecules are compared to the two rails of the ladder and each rail is made up of alternate joint molecule of sugar and phosphoric acid each rung of the ladder a pair of nitrogenous based joined by hydrogen bond adenine always pairs with thymine and cytosine always pair with guanine atcg remember ate kya g messenger rna that is mrna the rna molecule that carries the information of protein synthesis from genes that is dna chain in the cell in the cell nucleus to ribosome in the cytoplasm which produce the protein is called the messenger rna transfer rna trna the rna molecule which according to the message of the mrna carries the amino acid up to the ribosome is called transfer rna with the help of rna the genes present in the form of rna participate in the functioning of the cell and there by control the structure and functioning of the body information of protein synthesis is stored in the dna and synthesis is appropriate proteins as per required is necessary for body then these proteins are synthesized by dna through rna and it is called central dogma transcription mrna is produced as per the sequence of nucleotide on dna only one of the two strands of dna is used in this process observe the figure the sequence of nucleotide in mrna being produced is always complementary to the dna strand used for the synthesis besides this there is uracil in rna there will be uracil instead of thymine of dna this process of rna synthesis is called transcription translation each mrna is made up of thousands of platelet codons as per the message on mrna amino acids are supplied by the trna for this purpose trna has anti codon having complementary sequence to the codon on mrna this is called as translation the amino acid brought in by trna 
are bonded together by peptide bonds with the help of rRNA the mRNA formed in nucleus come in cytoplasm it brings in the coded message from dna the message contains the codes for amino acids the code for each amino acids consists of three nucleotides it is called as triplet codon dr hargobind khurana the scientist of indian origin has made an important contribution in discovery of triplet codon for 20 amino acids for this work he has been awarded with nobel prize in 1968 along with two other scientists marshall niren marshall niren berg and robert helly translocation during this process ribosome keeps on moving from one end of the mrna to the another end of the mrna through the distance of the one triplet codon this is called the translocation such many chains together form complex proteins these proteins control various functions in the body of living organism and their appearance too living organism can produce new individuals like themselves due to genes only and some of these genes are transmitted to the next generation without any change due to this same characters of parents are transmitted to their offspring however sometimes sudden change occur in those genes sometimes any nucleotide of the gene changes its position that causes a minor change which is called mutation sometimes mutations may be minor but sometimes it may be considerable for example mutation may cause the genetic disorders like sickle cell anemia albinism under the national health mission scheme the solubility test for diagnosis of sickle cell anemia is available at all district hospitals similarly the confirmatory diagnostic uh, diagnostic test electrophoresis is performed at rural and sub district hospitals this is a everlasting process and it is a proof one of the proof of darwin's theory of natural selection so friends we will see evolution in our next lesson